Can you not wrap your arms around me so tight? Where else am I going to put them? You drive like a maniac, fam. What am I supposed to do after we committed the robbery? Stick to the 20 mile per hour speed limit? Just be considerate, yeah? Oh, bro, are you serious? Hashtag me too! Hey, that's too far, fam. That's way too far. Oh, whatever, right? My vision for Swiped is making people more present. It's gotten to the point now where people are standing on the edges of buildings taking selfies. They're dying for likes. <laughs> Literally. You need to be more present, bruv. I just want to make people more present. Namaste, innit? We got out quick. <laughs> You're done, though. Right, what are you talking about? You weren't even there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but like, I timed you, innit? Like, shaved off last time by a whole 10 seconds and that. Yes. Do you feel guilty about what you do? Just like Jobs, Zuckerberg and Gates. We had a vision and now we're executing that vision. Again. Right, you lot, let's show them what we do with the phones, yeah? Okay, okay. Come on, you're making us look bad. Oh, it's heavy blood. Fuck this. Next. Yeah, I think, I think that's enough. It all started because of you, really, didn't it, hon? Here we go again. Neil got a new iPhone, and you kind of became a bit addicted to that phone, didn't you? I babe? wasn't addicted. I just really like Candy Crush Saga. It, it helps with your problem solving. Perhaps I used it a, a bit too much. Jordan noticed the effect that it had had on him, and I think that's when he came up with the idea. Yeah, nicked my phone off me on his bloody Vespa, didn't he? I don't know why they went to all that fuss. He could have just picked it up off the table. That, I believe, was the first moped phone robbery. Anyway, it all started with, like, Neil's phone. And ever since then, it's got bigger, like, much bigger. So, to confirm, he'll be at bus stop B. Bus stop B? At 7.30 a.m. Ray, you don't need to repeat everything she's saying. <laughs> Sure, isn't it? Okay, so he'll no doubt be engrossed in Grand Theft Auto, but now you can show him the real thing. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Right, I think we have everything we need. Yeah. Must not be seven foot yeah, yeah, man. Bye. See you later. Yeah. So everything was going really great with me and Aid until he got a free upgrade on his phone and then he got bloody glued to it. Hey, is the pasta all right? Yeah. Can you just, can you check it's not boiling over? What? Just check it's not boiling over. Yeah. I mean, pillow talk went out the window overnight. Babe, I'm naked. Are you coming? So anyway, a friend of mine had used the guy's service before and she recommended I get in touch. I was a bit nervous, but they were really professional. Hey! And now it's like our relationship is back in the honeymoon period. What are you looking at? It's like the moon stuff. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I mean, we actually talk and occasionally we even... I tried to get a new one, but I got them to nick that as well. Not again! Now his insurance premium is so high that he doesn't even have a phone. And aside from the PTSD, he really does seem so much happier now, don't you, babe? And I'm just waiting for him to grow a pair and pop the question. Jordan! Is that you? Yeah. Sorry, sorry, it's just <laughs> you all look the same. Because of the masks. The, um... Um, too hot wearing this man's eye. Too hot. Fair enough, Ooh. please. Yeah. I've been mean to thank you. Like, we are so grateful for everything you've done for us. Tell them how grateful we are. What? 
yeah, can't thank you guys enough for what you've done for us. Thank you. I was thinking, like, now that I'm sort of not as reliant on the phone and sort of wean myself off, maybe I could have it back. <laughs> <laughs> That's long. Joker fam. I'll do anything, man. <laughs> I'll even get one of those apps to limit my screen time, man. Come on. No, you addicts are all the same. Would you say you're a Buddhist? Would I say I'm a Buddhist? Yeah, I'd say I'm Buddhist. When we started this thing back in 2014, no one else was doing it. And then we had some dickhead copycats who misinterpreted our vision and started doing it for the wrong reasons. The Buddha would definitely not approve. Are you concerned that by not hiding your identity, you run the risk of going to prison? If that's the price we have to pay for getting our message out there, then so be it. Oh, shit. Hey, what? What? Hmm. I don't think you can ever catch someone on the back. Back in the day, though, I used to be the guy. I could catch a back calm, easy. But, you know, like, my knees and that. I'm a bit, bit rounder than I used to be, but it's all good though. Cheeks. I think Swiped is really, really great for sort of having the free service, get people interested, get them hooked and stuff. But if it was me running things, then I'd maybe start trying to build in some costs because like, think about the overheads. Okay, so regarding the Kickstarter campaign. Yeah, yeah so how much you want to try and raise then? I say at least 50 quid, you get me? Either go hard or go home, cuz. Look, I say we're in for a target of at least 100,000 which will be used to purchase a new fleet of electrical mopeds so that we can have a positive impact on the environment and people's mental health. Yeah, safe. Plus, I reckon we can use the extra cash to launch, like, a training programme where we can teach others the best way to swipe people's phones in a quick and properly efficient manner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Our ROI metric is happiness. And now we're going to pivot and roll it out nationwide. One day, we'll smile at our fellow man and women living together in peace and unity, just as Jesus would have wanted it. You were doing so well. Why just to bring Jesus into it? Because it's a holy mission, cuz. We're not extremists, right? What do I do when I'm not swiping phones? Well, I've actually just got into Pilates. Do you know it? It helps a lot with like core stability and stuff. Sometimes when I'm on the back of my Vespa, it does my back in. So it's been sorting me out quite a lot recently. What do you mean what do I do when I'm not swiping phones? Fam! I'm on job 24-7, fam. This is what I do, fam. I'm about this life. I ain't got nothing else to do, fam. This is serious things, you know what I'm saying? Blood. Blood. <laughs> yeah? Don't muck about, fam. Yeah? What kind of question is that, bruv? Sort yourself out, man. There's no limit to how big this could get. It's just how much planning and brains goes behind it. Do you know what I mean? Hashtag limitless. Hashtag successful. Hashtag gonna break the future.com It was just selfie after selfie with her. Yeah, I guess you could say she's a uh, selfie obsessed. <laughs> Sorry. Ready? All right, everyone smile. Ready to smile? No, like actual smile. I am smiling. Okay, fine. But after a while, I just I had to do something about it, so. <laughs> I did. My enemies wanna team up, try and film me and I smash the phone screen up. So filthy and I'm never gonna clean up. I'm gonna fuck the whole scene up. Yeah, cause that's on things. I get wicked on the mic, no long things. This, this is what I'm talking about. My guy with the dumb phone. See, we practice what we preach. Brad, what do you mean? I swiped this earlier, you know. What are you doing swiping dumb phones for? Them lot are on our side. Mom, you told me to swipe phones, cuz. God, you're an idiot. See, it's old school. Two megapixel. <laughs> <laughs>